Two cell mode. No healing fountains, but there are single health flask recharges occasionally, and we can buy some at the Stilt Village and other food shops if we come across them. This one will be tough. So let's go for it. Let's just go for it immediately. There's no chicken. Why is there no chicken? <gasps> Secret. Pizza than FTL. I might not play any FTL today because it is uh, kind of late already. And we've just been playing a lot of uh, a lot of dead cells today. I don't know. You think it broke? I would not be uh, saddened necessarily by the API broking, the Twitch integration. It yeah, it did it actually completely broke? Weird. Stream integration did stop stop working, so we are gonna have to reset. Funny. Does it not work on two cell mode? Play Gungeon, please. I've already played Gungeon. Good night, Aki. Go to sleep. Good night or good morning. How come it's not working? There it goes. I guess winning cut out the uh, the Twitch integration. But let's do one more. Let's do one more. Two cell mode this time. No health fountains, but there are some single recharge health flasks. I'm, I'm gonna need a good chicken, and ideally, no bosses. <laughs> I would love to not have to worry about bosses killing me, but, because that's probably not gonna happen, just try to play nice. Try not to murder me too hard. Littaloo. Well, welcome, and uh, hello to being my chicken. Where are we gonna go? Oh, absolutely, come on, bring it on. Hey, get back here. Really? Oh, shit. Freaking zombies! Really don't love this, uh, this rapier, but I guess for the time being, it's all we have. Really, actually, I don't like rapiers in this game. They used to be pretty good, and then they got nerfed in uh, early access, and now they're just kind of like, eh. They do extra damage if you're uh, on a dodge roll, but you could just use, like... The assassin's blade and get in behind an enemy pretty quickly. You're dying because I'm not playing Gungeon. I already played Gungeon! I'm sorry. I'm sorry if you missed it. There's my other scroll. Get back here. Oh, there's another one. Wait, how did I get an extra level of Strength. Oh, the root grenade. Okay. Well, chat, choose my improvements. What do you want to see? Brute tactics. This is actually a good place to stop for a second. Survival to start's not too bad for the health. You didn't choose. How do you do this bird thing? So Lilith 2, if you at Abe Clancy and then you type a message, it'll appear on the screen. And then the only other thing you do is when I ask for a heal, you can either choose to heal me or you can choose to ignore my heal. Okay, bird? Okay. Um, let's go. I'm, I'm waiting for chat to decide what the other scroll is gonna be before I decide what this scroll is gonna be. More brute? 
All right, we'll go more brute. I would not be adverse to some sort of a... <laughs> All the peeps are gonna flock to the stream. All of your bird peeps? Wouldn't mind having like a frost grenade right now, but obvi obviously that's not gonna happen. Come on. <laughs> Burb jokes. At least with the extra strength, we are killing these guys quickly. Ah, I could go get that oiled sword. Should I go for uh, go for some more blueprints? We can probably go for some more blueprints. Where are we going? Half condemned, half toxic sewers. Might not have enough time to hit the uh, timed door right now, though. Unless it's lit. Unless the exit is right down here, which it is. Let's go. Gotta try to hit that time door. And it's only two cells, so I can't do the Moonflower key short... Not shortcut, but the uh, secret. Jump, poison, bombs. Well, I know which one I want. Jump. I wanna jump. I wanna jump! Jump, 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 jump! Jump, 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 jump. Lilla too, you've been a good bird, but it is gonna kick you out of the, out of the bird position here in a second. I'm sorry, there's nothing I can do. Poison? <laughs> Don't poison me, pro potato. Hey, but thank you for the follow. <laughs> you can poison me now. Well, I don't think we're gonna hit that time door because it's not here. One sec, zero seconds. We were zero seconds away from the time door. Fuck. If only it placed it a little bit sooner, we would have had it. You know what? You have a blueprint for me? No, you don't. What you do have is a freaking ton of damage. You know what? Hey, Bruxtel. How's it going? Oh, oh, oh. Well, that's a much better weapon. Lilitu, thank you for the follow as well. LJ says hi. Oh, that was a waste of a grenade. Yo, you're very fast, Mr. Bombardier. Your good burb trust you? I have to, I have no choice. Give me a new shield. Give me a good shield. That's a good shield. Hey, Bombardier. Aha, you have Oh, shit. I need a heal. I got hit with some knockback, unfortunately. Thank you. I got the... I took some extra damage, but at least I got the blueprint from him. I guess now I should go for maybe another grenade. Oh, I have 930 bucks. <laughs> it's not nearly enough. Uh, can you kick open the doors? You can just roll through them or you can press right bumper to open them normally. You chose to heal me. You know, it's not a bad time for a heal. I, I tend to not Heal myself because I'm like, oh, I'll just uh, save my healing pots. But you know what? We got another blueprint. Let's try to get this blueprint to the exit.
The closed ones? Oh, you need uh, stem cells, which means that you need to defeat the final boss once and then loop. Once you loop, you can open those doors. That's how you open those background wooden doors. I must protect you. Put it the raven. Hey, we got a grenade. Survival increased. I guess people are a little bit worried about my HP, and you know what? I cannot blame you. Oh, shit! Can't hit him. Wow! Holy shit! How come? Ah, oh, because my grenade wasn't ready. Well, there goes all of my health. Again. You just... <laughs> I gotta save some heals for the boss fight, man. Then again, I am the one taking the damage. Not clutching anything. Nothing there. Shit. Usually they don't follow you. Yes, they don't follow you uh, when you hit an elevator. Freaking flying assholes! There are limited heals, but uh, it's still probably good that we collected them or picked up those heals and used them. That's what I meant to say. Not uh, not the other words. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I had a sneeze. Ah, oh, whew. Okay, I'm better now. People are saying ramparts? We can go ramparts. Into the stilt village? It's probably smart. We can get those extra heals. Which we're probably gonna need. No. You die because I fell on your head. That's the rule. Why'd you turn around? Well, thanks for joining us, food importer. You've been a good burb. You're a very good burb. Okay. Bye, food boy. But let's go 42. Thank you for the follow. And welcome to Jurassic Park. Jump, blood, or chicken? You know, blood might not be that bad if I can get some healing out of it, but we don't need the healing right now. Chicken is probably the best one. Get some nice little chicken. Some nice little firing, attacking chickens. Did I get a blueprint? Yes, I did. What was it? Wave of Denial. Repels all nearby enemies. That seems horrible. Although I guess it depends on how frequently it can be reused. Yeah, the chicken's gonna leave, but then you can be the chicken again by saying, pick me. And if you get picked as a chicken, you're a chicken. I'm not a chicken, you're a turkey. Chicken Thor! Hey, nice. Alright, Chicken Thor. This is all you, buddy. This is all you! Whoever you're gonna be.
Rockstone Knights, the Chicken Thor! So as Chicken Man, you don't have to do anything. It'll, you're just going to be doing a lot of damage over time for me. You are my chicken. My chicken master. I'm back, baby! I saw it. There's a secret. I'm gonna go get it. It's a super secret. It's a freaking challenge room. Let's go. You're a battle chicken. That is true. Oh, yes! Fantastic. Let's get the hell out of here. I love the music in this game. Why would you ever not go the upper path? <laughs> the game basically magnetizes you to platforms. I don't think I've ever missed a jump like that. They have meat bow saws in this game? I don't think they have meat bows. Hey. Boy. Oh. Meat boy? Oh, meat boy, not meat bow. I get you. I don't think so. Uh oh. That's fine. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, big boy. Is this the exit already? Alright, well. Hello? Hello? Ah, there we go. <laughs> I just wondering where the door was. Well, we found the exit already, which is kind of surprising. Quite do a lot of damage with the assassin's blade here, but we're working on it. Now we're not we're not done yet. Don't worry. You're gonna stick around for a little bit while longer, chicken. Gotcha. You're not leaving us quite yet, chicken. cell door. I found all the cell doors so far. Look at down there. Uh, I guess to the right there's gonna be another little section. Yep. An order, to the, order from the king. Still not quite, not, not quite entirely sure why you need to destroy every single door in the entire world, but you know what? Good luck and have fun. Survival increase, 717. Oh shit! We'll come back. <laughs> I'll come back to you in a second, buddy. Hopefully with the ivy grenade we can actually kill him pretty quickly. Hey, boss! As long as that grenade can stun him, it's actually pretty nice. What's with the survival? I'll need some more attack at some point. I think I hit a bit of a groove right here. Because we're just running and killing. Food shop. Uh, unfortunately, we don't need it. I would love to have had 27,000 gold to be able to afford the uh, healing potion, but we don't got that kind of money. Ah. Get 
You know what? Get parried. Open sesame, yeah. I'm trying my best. Oh, here we go. Better grenade. Four plus instead of two. I really like the root grenade holding enemies in place for uh, an extended period of time, though. Thing is, the two plus is giving me extra levels of brutality. I think we'll keep what we have. It's not enough of an upgrade for me to be super excited about it, is the, is the thing. Ah. Like the last enemy, scroll. This game looks complex. It's not that complex. You know, minus the secrets and stuff. Ooh. Drop the scroll. I'm glad you guys didn't decide on survival. I need more brute. We're gonna be fighting a boss next. HP is fine. Hold on, there's a weirdo in my yard. <laughs> oh, don't worry, that's just me. We're done. There's actually quite a bit left to explore. We only need to hit the Time door by 17 minutes. The problem is we have to fight a boss first. Right. Oh, thank God that lasted long enough. Damage from projectiles reduced. Both basically the same, unfortunately. Kind of hoping for a bigger upgrade, but you know, at least it gives us some money. Money that we didn't have earlier world into that one. Your dog won't shut the hell up. <laughs> Stupid dog. I'm missing something. Is there just like nothing else here? This is just a room full of enemies. Okay. I can dig it. He dropped a turkey. Well, I have to go pick up the turkey. I guess I should have probably waited a little bit, but we're basically done. One small area left, as long as I don't take damage, that'll be fine. That little small mistake won't have mattered. We're good. Well, actually, we still have to actually kill this guy. Actually. Hey. Thanks, chicken. Bam, bam. For potatoes helping with the chest. Yeah. Vampirism. Ah, oh, it's so bad. <laughs> BRB bird. What's over there? How much time do we have? We have enough time I can check out this one last zone. Literally nothing. Okay. Black bridge, black bridge. It was a food shop, but we have full health. So we don't need no stinking food shop. Hey, cell dude. Hello there, Mr. Prisoner, sir, hey, hey, sir, hey. 
30% HP. See if we can upgrade something. 14,000 gold. Assassin's Dagger 2, Cudgel 3. We're probably going to be get, getting rid of these at some point. I think we're fine. I'd like to replace some weapons in the Stilt Village here. Or after this boss fight. Like that. See, that's why I like Ross's Ranica. That's why I like. Stay away from me. This stun shield, man. If you can get the parry, you're in a good place. Oh, what's that? You tried to jump? I don't think so, buddy. Hold him in place. Oh! <laughs> he scared me. Time to be a nice boss for once. <laughs> that was almost too easy. Well, that's what I like. <laughs> simple. Simple, 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 simple. Lightning bolt. It's a lot of damage at range. I think I'm gonna take that over the shield for now. I'll replace the shield later. But having some sort of a ranged attack is gonna be kinda nice. Puppies, flowers, other gentle boss commands. They should let you do the at send me a message and it'll appear over your head like I'm going to murder you that'd be kind of fun if the boss could talk and the chicken could talk at the same time alas that is not the case we'll hold off on changing weapons or anything like that we're done here, we're done here oh a heal Yes! A healing flask. I think we are gonna go gas. I like gas! Especially because we know that there is going to be a... Uh... I will be your chicken forever. Oh, Nice chicken. Especially because we know that there's gonna be a... Uh... A food shop. The turkey will fully heal us with gas. 100%. So even if we're on 1 HP, it's a full heal. Which is kind of nice. Okay. Spikers. Ugh. That's not gonna suck at all. No, spoilers, it's gonna suck. Also, where's the time door? There it is. So there is our scroll of power for free. Oh, you got me. You got me again. Get out of here. I don't need healing, I just need to uh, get to the shop. We'll be fine. I gotta remember what my uh, items are here. I don't have the shield anymore. That's the thing that kind of tricked me up a little bit. Lightning is actually not that bad here. I guess we're going brute build again. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I like brute build. All right. Would you stop that? Is 
chest over here. Just in case it's a, uh, a cursed chest, we should deal with it now. It's a cursed chest. Well, I'm glad we're dealing with it now. <laughs> Pick peck poo. Garbage. Extra stats. And then we have to do this again. Take two. You know what? Pop the grenade on him. All right, six enemies remaining. Oh, scroll. You guys really want to split between brute and serve. Gotcha. Oh, why don't you turn it around, buddy? Yeah, yeah. Oh, he can't turn around? What's wrong? Oh. What the hell's that? A Super Hokuto's bow. Isn't it good? Plus 250 DPS for 20 seconds. Oh, that's not very good at all. Big frickin' pirate man? Whatever his name is. So this should be the shop, the food shop. The flask is 38,000, pie's 2,300. We can definitely afford the pie, and we should be able to afford the flask in a, in a bit. Oh! You know what? Fine. Get out of here. Freaking jerks. Now, unfortunately, this guy doesn't have a backside, but I can still smack him. Oh, Inquisitors? What? Since when? Oh, well, since uh, cell mode. Oh, shit. Don't heal, don't heal, I got it, I got it. Don't heal. So that's why there's a food shop, that's why we're going to the food shop. Don't heal, oh my god, you, ugh. I said don't heal. I was just gonna go buy the turkey, it's full health. Where's the, where's the way up? What? Oh, I guess he was too close to the wall, so when I tried to slide in next to him, I was a little bit too far away, I guess. God, I hate you guys. Freaking little jerks who teleport. I might still need the turkey. These guys are being annoying. What have we got? A couple things left to do down here. I still don't know what's in the other shop room. At least I don't remember visiting it. Maybe I did. Anything in here? Yeah, no, we haven't been here yet. Just weapons. I mean, we could go for a new sword at some point. But I'm gonna save my money for the heals. We're gonna need them.
We're a little bit light on flasks now. You die. Gotcha. I'm basically using the Ivy Grenade like a Frost Grenade, but the thing is, Frost Grenade is just so much better. The thing is, the Frost Grenade gives you so much damage reduction that it's almost always going to be better. I guess sometimes you can uh, get good results out of the ivy grenade because it keeps them locked in place, they can't turn around. But that doesn't work for very long on bosses. The frost doesn't work very long either. But at least you get the damage reduction. So where are we gonna go? Sepulcher? Clock Tower? I'm thinking Sepulcher. He can turn around when he's in the middle of his attack. Also, those things can hit you even though you're not on the ground. Lovely. Oh, this is very annoying. Roll through the door! Okay, I can't get up there, apparently. So that's interesting. If that guy is in his attack animation, he can turn around. That's strange. I would have not thought that. Just go through the door. Oh my fucking god, that room sucks. Sure, let's do this. I went through the door. I went through the wall. Get down by the chest. Pause time. Stop rolling. Oh my god. <laughs> well, we're gonna fight him down here, I guess. At least we had the fire to help us out. I gotta go back up there to the chest now. At least chat's still hitting this thing. I really don't like that the. Uh, that pirate captain can turn around. Okay, that's much better. That's much better. That's my damage reduction. Community codex down here. Might as well pick this up before we fight the elite. Basically all Ranakil. Getting that chest open. Please, please go. Fuck. Climb! Oh my god. Jesus. It's a good weapon, though. You can't recover a little bit of HP from this. Dude, that sucked. <laughs> ah. So, the, okay, you wanna know what happened there? I'm gonna go through it. So I walk into the room, you know, I'm gonna fight these guys. I hit the elite with a grenade because, I mean, I'm gonna be fighting the elite, right? It's not the pan- ugh. It's not panic. So I activate the elite. The elite activation pushes me back into the spikes that I was avoiding. I was actively avoiding those spikes and I was going, going to dodge them, but it pushes me back into the spikes. So I take damage from that, right? So then I start falling. Then I start getting hit when I'm trying to run through the enemies. The frickin' Inquisitor hits me when I'm running by him. Ugh! And then I got hit at the end there because I was trying to... And I had lost my YOLO because I was trying to jump over the Elite and it wasn't jumping over him. He was just like, hey, I'm gonna get hit by you. Ah, it's dumb. Don't do that. Ugh, anyways. Silly! 
That was very silly. Let's get the hell out of here. Well, let's get the hell out of here after we buy some food. Should have enough for what I want, which is this. And this, which is for health. Full health. Could have saved a little bit of money not buying the full health, but that freaking uh, elite enemy got me. Anyways. I'll admit though, I am uh, I'm kind of not a fan of when you activate the elites to kind of push you back. Sometimes that can happen. They push you back into something that you're dodging into a trap. I guess that's just part of it. Part of the experience. <sighs> Spikes, shots, doors. Doors is the best one. If you want to be nice. Still think we want gas. Guess now we should take dead inside. Damage taken, but you recover 1% of your health. How much damage reduction do I have? 30%. Yeah, no. Reforge. Double damage inflicted is a little bit better, but... Oh! I don't have enough money to reforge this anymore. Oh, well, that was dumb. <laughs> Bye, Pro Potato 2. It's been fun. Well, you know what? It's not a boss fight, so I can probably come out of this with full health if I don't take a ton. Spikes, 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 doors, doors. Shots, spikes. Oh my god, you freaking assholes. You freaking jerks! That's okay. I can handle some spikers. Probably. Hey, Bruxel Knight. Welcome back. Oh, hey. Yeah, let's do it. See how good this is going to work. We actually did get back up to full health, but I was attacking him as I was taking damage too. Hello again, or hey ho again. There's an elite there, and an inquisitor there. Well, I don't understand what's happening. It's like, where was the light? <laughs> There was no lights. Oh, a free turkey! Tight passage. Oh, yeah. Dude, a free turkey is so good. So basically, Bruxtel Knight, you're my, you're my chicken. Do not heal. Do not heal me ever. Healing is bad. Now, admittedly, I do need to get back up there for the light. I'm gonna have to sneak my way through past this elite, I think. There we go. Shit, that's not what I meant to do, but you know what? We're gonna fight him anyways. Gotcha. Okay. Poison has no effect on you. Damage from projectiles reduced 75%. Poison not affecting me would be kind of nice because if we get a, uh, a modifier that is, oh, uh, when you get hit, you get poisoned, it just won't affect me. Theoretically. Oh. Ah. 
This is, why am I here? I have to ask myself that question. Why am I here? There's nothing there. So let's just ignore that place entirely. Let's move on. Oh, time door, or not time doors, cell doors. I always forget about those. We're gonna get some extras. Why am I here then? <laughs> You're here to be uh, emotional support. Oh, hey, stop that. I need some uh, some support. Tell me it's gonna be all right. You know, the fast attack of this weapon actually means that that plus 1% HP recovered per attack is not bad. Now, nah, man, I need emotional support. <laughs> okay. It's alright, chicken. It'll all be okay. Let me give you a nice little pet there. Oh, okay. Always pet your chicken. Serve, serve, serve. You should, um, if you're focusing on giving me HP, you should give me a couple of points in tactics, in purple. Um, I will still get, you know, 12% HP off of one level of tactics at level four. You know, until tactics gets to eight, I'm still gaining health from it. Actually, it's like until tactics level 14 or something like that, I'm still gaining HP from it. So don't worry about giving me um, a couple of levels of tactics. You don't even look when you when I pet you. I don't want to make it too awkward. I'm gonna keep these weapons. I might actually want to get a shield for damage reduction, especially now that I have this uh, this gauntlet that is legendary and gives me HP recovery. Did I get the key? I did get the key. What is this? Serve for life. <laughs> I should have remembered. <laughs> Everyone's like, no, no, never. No, no, no tactics, only survival. All right, well. Whatever you want, I guess. Oh, fuck. I almost got hit by this guy in the back. Keep trying to get in behind the enemies, like, getting behind them is going to allow me to get a crit or something. That's not how that works. A better ice grenade, I will definitely take it. Ice grenade for freezing and damage reduction, kind of a little bit old, but it works. Yeah, the infinity gauntlet. Hayabusa gauntlets. They're really good. I like these as weapons. Electric whip. Oh. oh, tactics and survival, 50-50. Who's gonna win? Oh, it's a 50-50 split! Hell yeah. So let's see. Yeah, 11% HP with tactics, 7% HP with survival. So at least for one point, it is still worth it. Next time you play Gungeon, do a run as a robot with nine curses, you must break all chests. Eh, probably not. Open some chests. I guess you didn't say I couldn't take item rooms and uh oh no, I have to break all chests. You didn't say I couldn't take boss items. Gotcha. Dude, let's go. It's probably a dumb idea.
especially with a trap room right here. <laughs> let's go backwards and actually fight some enemies for once. And by backwards, I mean, let's go to the beginning of the frickin' game and slowly walk forwards and backwards. Hey. I'm gonna want this now. You know, I, we could just go full survival. Hello. I actually don't really need points in brutality if I have two legendary items. It could work. Hey, get back up. I can't get back up? Oh, that's the problem. Oh, get out. Four enemies remaining, we can do that. There we go, I can wall jump up it. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, I could just go full survival now. Skip the brute. We'll see what happens. Need to kill a couple more enemies first. Depends on how many extra scrolls we get to. If it's gonna make too much of a difference. Mushroom guy like looks way different outside the gungeon. <laughs> ah, there's a scroll over there. Hmm. Let's head back to the right. It's kind of. I was actually kind of hoping that the grenades up there would have stayed, but they went down and attacked me earlier. One remaining. Easy. Oh, crap. We're in deep. Our HP is fine, surprisingly. We were in deep for a second there. We got out. Although, I won't be able to really Climb the freaking chain. We'll be able to come back here and make progress without getting progress without getting hit again. And then the game gives me freaking two of these lanterns. Jerk ass game. Um oh. That was a nice hit! Oil grenade. You don't want to be in deep. <laughs> we don't have anything that lights enemies on fire unless they do like a, a falling attack. Infantry grenade. It's fine. Oil grenade does almost the same amount of damage, which is weird. I don't know, oil grenade could have a use. It's not that difficult to get items that make it so that when you fall, you create fire. Do a, a smashing downwards attack. A smashing attack. Smashing. Absolutely smashing. I wish I could fly through the walls like the bird. How did I just heal? So, blood... No, not blood. Uh, the gauntlets. The gauntlets... <laughs> have a ability, which means I take more damage, but I also heal. 1% of HP recovered per attack, so I am healing slowly when I'm hit hitting things. So I do have a sort of built-in healing on this run right now, which is kind of cool. Where are we going? Guess we're going down here. All right, this was the cursed chest. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. It is pretty nice, but 
you do have to be careful that you don't take a, a ton of damage. But with 15,000 HP, basically, um, we're actually in a very good position, I think. I just need to find a shield to replace this uh, lightning bolt right now. Welcome back, food boy. Food boy. This is garbage. Might as well keep the lightning as opposed to the frickin' daggers. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Excuse me. Okay, that's pretty frickin' sweet. They just come at me in a line, and I'm just like, nope, 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 nope. Reattack these guys? Eh, they just give me money. Clock tower, clock tower boss might destroy me, though. I'm kind of scared about that. Did I die after you left? I don't remember when you left, but I did die a couple of times. On, like, the first frickin' floor of a couple of runs. I-I-R-C. I think we're done. What was this shop? Shield? Shields! 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 My favorite shield. I am very happy now. I think this is a pretty good build. 20, 40, 65% damage reduction. Yes, I do take double damage, but I do heal off of that. Turkey's getting cold. I'm going for the turkey. Ah, right, we should go. We'll get a little bit closer to the turkey anyways. We'll grab the turkey and we'll get the hell out of here. Hopefully we can get the turkey and get back in time before we take too much damage. Yeah, plenty of time. Plenty of time, my sweet. Plenty of time. I could go and fight those elites down there and then get the turkey, but whatever. Just ignore the elites. Who cares? Yes, food. I remember I wanted to say that I wanted to try to find a way to make the sound effects work for only the chicken. I think that would be cool. Oh, I could get a new grenade. Because the oil grenade is just for damage. It doesn't do anything. I could get a fire grenade. I wouldn't be able to reroll anything. But you know what? It gives me damage reduction. I'll take it. The damage over time is going to be nice, and anything, yeah. I, the Hayabusa gauntlets, double damage to a burning target. I think we need something that burns enemies. That's more important than rerolling anything, I think. It's kind of kind of a, a same old, same old boring run that we've had a, 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 many times before, where we just have a fire grenade and an ice grenade. It just, it works. It just works. You're gonna try to get Food Boy as the bird. All right, you do that. Let's not re-roll. Let's see what happens if we just go for it. Slowly rebuilding the healing, which is nice. Up to three. Go. Do it, boy, go, cheers, heart, good luck. Back up to full health. I mean, I took a little bit of damage, but we kind of recovered it very quickly.
doing a ton of damage to this freaking girl. Hey, chicken. Let's finish this. This is kind of, uh, kind of nice. destroy this boss almost at full health and I did like half of the boss's damage before anyone even became the uh, <laughs> the boss <laughs> dude that was really freaking good so now what do we want a better shield that has more damage reduction sure 35% instead of 20 I know I just bought this shield but yeah I'll upgrade Just a lot of damage thanks to these gauntlets and the uh, the healing actually did manage to heal me more than I, I took damage. That was very nice. 35% of items are now plus plus. We're making good progress. Feels good to be the bird again. Hey, well, welcome back food importer. I don't know if you're going to stay the bird when I walk into the next zone because it is another area. I have no idea. We'll see. And give you a little pet. Aww. Pet bird. Pet burb. Hopefully you will become the bird. You didn't get a chance to do anything. I guess that's a good thing. No, oh, pet the bird, a little pet. Yeah, come on. Poison me. Poison me. Freaking do it. Let's go. You're gonna poison me? Poison me? Yeah, let's do it. Oh no, I'm poisoned! Oh no, what am I gonna do? <laughs> seven triumphant seven. Oh, thank you for the follow. <laughs> oh. You're gonna poison me. Show you how much I care about poison. Spoilers, I don't! Community codex. Let's let's go serve. If the community wanted serve, let's go serve. We have things that synergize with it. Let's see if we can get like 20,000 health. Let's freaking go. Dude, absolutely. Don't focus. Ah, oh, freaking. Dumbass biters. Stop hitting. Ah, who cares? Stop hitting the chest. How much damage reduction do we have? 20, 40, 60. 80, we have 100% damage reduction, which caps at 75%. So honestly, I should probably get rid of one of my, uh, like get rid of the ice grenade, replace it for an oil grenade. I know I just recycled an oil grenade, but I only re thought about it now. But we should definitely do something like that. Maybe I will try to like buy a, an oil grenade or I don't know. I don't know what what I'm looking for. Something else. Something uh, a little bit more useful than what we have. I'll go Green Door. Green Door is the Roly Poly Man. I can deal with Roly Poly Man. Okay, I got wrecked. I'm still getting wrecked. 
Are, are you seeing how many freaking enemies there are down here? Who's Roly Poly Man? The guy who you, you hit him on the back. Because his front's a shield. Or no, you hit him in the front because his back's a shield, rather. Fucking Sonic the Hedgehog Boy. Okay, you know what? Why are there so many enemies here? All on this, like, there's no enemies up or down. They're all just on the same damn platform. What the hell? All right, this is Roly Poly Man. Hey, come here. You're an easy elite to fight. I want to take advantage of this uh, force field. Get a little bit of healing out of it. That's Mr. Roly Poly Man, Hedgehog. Sonic, whatever you want to call him. You don't look like no roly poly to me. Oh! We're gonna almost rolled into the trap. Don't do that. Yo, I would love to get out of this floor at full health due to the fact that I have this uh, heal. Healing ability, rather. Okay, easy, easy, easy. Hey, hit me. Yeah, give me, give me shields. Give me shields. Give me all the shields. Gotcha. Not as useful as the stun, I think. I don't know, I feel like I want to focus down one enemy and not aggro a whole bunch with the shield that might just kind of wear off in the middle of combat or something. This feels pretty nice, though. It's not worthless or anything. Serve brute tact. Probably anything will work at this point. What is this? Grenade six plus plus. All right, well, I'll take this grenade six plus plus then. Extra level of attack for the healing, for the health rather, or healing. Gotcha. You gonna pull me? Hopefully you just burn. I'm getting good on, or uh, I've been pretty good on these parries. Just almost die so I can save you. <laughs> this is one of those runs where that's a bad idea if we can avoid it. Oh, you're gonna get screwed, buddy. I'm sorry. Will shield protect me from spikes? Should check that out. Yes! Yes! Get wrecked! Oh, get wrecked again, almost. Oh. Got it. The damage reduction is keeping me alive here while I mess up my parry run into a group of enemies and get hit by an Inquisitor. Okay. Oh! Don't stand there! I do admit, Frost Grenade against these guys is really freaking nice. Frost grenade just keeps them in place. I 
can't do shit about it. I wish there was something, some way that you could parry kind of a long ranged attack and still have a force field. Get the head. You got me. They got me, but I got him back. I got him back good. Where are we? At the beginning? Almost gone full circle. Your favorite part of my streams is the sexy voice. Oh! Well, it's sexy. It's gotta be sexy to someone, right? That's what my mama told me. Hey, Pufflesaurus! Thank you for the follow, Puffle. Puffle, puffle. Oh god, there's so many of them. And Shigon24. I read those in the wrong order. But thank you both, regardless. Hey. Come on, stop trying to hit me and hit me. This is another good shield. If you don't have one of those anti, uh, those stun shields, uh, anti-stun. All right, you're so slow. But I still think I prefer the stun shield. <laughs> and thank you for the host with one viewer. Okay. It's hard to get the parry when he's slow. His attack pattern doesn't really make a lot of sense. 8,000 DPS if covered in oil. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna hold off on this for a second. I might be able to find out a way of making the boss covered in oil. And at that damage level, If I can find a way of making him get covered in oil, I'd probably want that. How do I know so much about Gungeon? Just played it. Played it for so long. I've learned. Oiled sword. Oh, well, I mean, I've got these awesome gauntlets. An awesome oiled sword could be nice, but I don't, I don't need a sword. I guess maybe an oil grenade, which again, I'm kind of sad that I did get rid of an oil grenade a little earlier and just munched it. I just sold it to the nothing that is whatever I sell items to. It's probably gonna be the eggs. Exit? No? Excuse me. You like that parry? Oh, it's a freaking Inquisitor! You know, I should kill him. Should probably kill him first before I do this, but you know what? Let's see what this is. This. <laughs> God damn. It does basically the same damage as my gauntlets, but I don't take double damage, but I don't heal. I want to try to do a healing... boss fight, maybe? With 16,000 HP, it could work well. I know this does scale... with green. You can't type, you're dying inside, why? He's gonna teleport to me. He's 
Easy peasy, extra jump in midair. Excellent. I'm trying to go for a parry by sliding in. It didn't work. Oh. I got it. I got the parry. <laughs> if you can get that force shield and you can get in there. Oh, good lord. Hey, you buy. I don't need it. He slowed. It's so hard to tell what the enemies are going to do when they're slowed that much. Yeah, I'm thinking oil grenade could be kind of cool. Uh, was there a shop? There's two shops. I wish I didn't sell the one that I had earlier. Uh, this is a shield weapon shop. I think this is also a shield weapon shop, isn't it? Yep. There is actually no shop that I could buy anything from, unfortunately. So we are done! We've done everything! We've explored everything! I haven't found the exit yet. Ah, oh, it's gonna be way up there, okay. Being a burb is hard. <laughs> so we're done. We, we've explored the entire floor. There are gonna be two items at the end of the floor now that we have all three of the keys. So we can maybe get something else here that we can take with us instead of one of our grenades. Assassin's Dagger, nope. One extra community codex. Probably survival would be best. I could try looking for an oiled sword. There's nowhere else to look is the problem. There, There is nowhere else to look. We've explored everything. It's, it's done, we've explored everything. The shops do not... Oh, I see. Look for a sword, not a grenade. I mean... 8,000 DPS if we have a sword. I'd have to get rid of the shield. I could get rid of a shield for that. I mean, I don't, I don't want the infantry grenade. We'll get rid of this. Okay, you know what? I mean, might as well. We might as well. You know what? You got a point. You got a point. I kept thinking about grenades. An oiled sword could do something. Oh, well, there's one. Yeah, I see enemy with inflammable oil, and then that thing would do 8,000 DPS on a crit. You know, I, I kind of wanted to stick with what we have. Although I was really hoping to get rid of, rid of the grenade for something else, but. Hmm. I wanna try it because I wanna see if the, um, the heal actually does make it worthwhile, the 1% HP recovered per attack. I want to see if that makes this run work, if it makes it worthwhile to have that double damage modifier on it. Yeah, we'd have to get rid of the uh, gauntlets and the rampart. The thing is, this ice grenade is just worthless. I need to get rid of it. I could... I could see if I have enough cells to unlock something else, but I don't think we do. I really wish I did not get rid of that oil grenade. Ugh, that was a dumb mistake. You know what, let's just go. If the if the frost grenade is worthless, it's worthless. It's not giving us any extra damage reduction, it's just kinda not doing anything, really. I wanna see if the 1% heal is gonna be worth it. 91 cells, the problem is I just don't have anything to unlock. I guess I could unlock Wave of Denial and Tornado and see what these do.
They won't scale, but that's okay. Repels all nearby enemies. If an enemy is thrown against a wall, it takes plus 91 damage. So every seven seconds, I can push things away. Inflicts damage on all targets caught inside, changes direction when it hits a wall. <laughs> well, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> it also poisons the enemy. I can't use it that frequently, though. Does a force field from boss fights count as a wall? I don't think so. Oh, th that force field. Yeah, it does, I think. Uh, damage reduction is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 75%. We don't need the frost grenade at all. I'm going to take the wave of denial. I'm thinking I can push enemies around with this. I could maybe push enemies into a pit. I could knock them off the upper platform. I don't know. There's something we can do with this. It's more interesting than nothing. Successful parries deal damage. Let's dump points into those. Let's do it. We want dead inside. Grenade cooldown. I could also, I could get efficiency. Triage, tough nut, velocity. The burb is leaving. We're gonna, we're gonna need a new burb. Wave of denial efficiency doesn't seem like it would be that useful. Bleeding poisoned or burned. Sadism, but plus 349 DPS, is that worth it? Probably not. I might want recovery. Allow me to get some extra healing in. Damage reduction from traps is nice too, but as long as I don't fall into the trap, we'll be okay. So let's not fall into the trap. Instead, let us upgrade some of these items, like the fire grenade. We're gonna, we know we're gonna want this, so let's upgrade it to give us a skill point. Brutality, which is basically meaningless, but sure, whatever. Sure, I mean, we'll upgrade it. Damage to a burning target. Sure. Let's go! The gauntlets do double damage on a burning target, so they can do like 12,000 DPS. It's kind of a lot. Thing is, they, the gauntlets attack quickly, so the lifesteal might be meaningful. Whee! I hope it's meaningful. Damage output is meaningful. Okay. Oh, don't hit, get hit by those. So basically what I'm thinking is, oh, we pushed him out. healing in. Yeah. No, that's gonna hit. Oh, I have the, the parry. I have a shield now. Oh, I lost it. You know what? Uh, 
kind of like the parry, sh uh, this parry shield that I've been using here. Oh. See, this is the this is the problem. This is what I was kind of worried about being so many uh, zombie enemies right now. Oh. Stop it. Hey, get back here. Need a heal, need a heal. Thank you. What? Oh my god, I hate, hate that. I hate when it feels like you should have uh, made your dodge or your jump or something and it doesn't work. Also, I really hate the uh, zombies. Yeah, I mean, minus minus the the boss attacks from Twitch, it wasn't that bad. What? Thank you, food importer. Good job, bird. Nice little pet. All right there. Oh, such a good little bird. Yeah, I had such high amount of health. Damage resistance and uh, the one percent extra heal, one percent heal per hit. My HP was fine. It was just the attacks from the elites and the zombies that were kind of wearing me down. Hmm. Nice. So I guess that does work. You know, maybe if you can just stack up the HP, get fifteen, twenty thousand HP, seventy-five percent damage reduction, and one percent damage back as health on a weapon that maybe is legendary and scales with survival, you can have a, a really strong run. Now, of course, that's not going to work necessarily on the four stem cell mode, because on four stem cell mode, you're going to have to worry about things like, oh, you are going to get freaking diseased with the malaise. Seems like the winds reset integration. Yeah, that's kind of unusual. Do I have the Moonflower unlock? No, I would be doing that on the next run. Um, but I'm not going to play another run today. I think I am gonna, going to call the stream quits here because it is late. But I want to thank everyone for watching. And for those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for more. And I hope to see you here again for the next run of Dead Cells.